one. Welcome to Third Eye Visions, where we motivate the blind, stimulate your mind, and welcome all kind. Y'all haven't heard that in a while, but anyway, my name is Anthony, and I urge you all to continue to subscribe to Third Eye Visions. Please hit the like button. Please hit the like button. Make sure to tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend. Today, I want to talk about the duties and then I think that I think strongly uh, of the duties of a man provider and the title of it is it's a man's duty to provide for um, his family you know I thought about this uh, while growing up and um, I've, I'm glad that I've had the privilege of, of being raised by my father rest in peace um, he instilled a, 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 a lot in me in terms of what a man was supposed to do. And I've instilled that in uh, my sons as well. More specifically, my nine-year-old, I instill it in every day about wh what a man's duty is. But these days, uh, society has kind of gotten away from that. And there have been a lot of females out there who are being the provider of the family. And I'll get into that in some other route. But I just wanted to come and talk to you about it is a man's duty to provide for his family. Now, this this really touches me more so because as a visually impaired person, uh, I, I, I really, really uh, try to hammer this home because I don't ever want to be a person just to sit around not you know, provide a, uh, for my family. Uh, I don't mind my, my, my other half working and doing what she has to do, but I just feel less of a person if they're going out doing what they have to do and I'm at home chilling, relaxing, or not really trying to find a way to provide. And that seems to, in most cases, a lot of people that I know have been become the, the way of, of, the, uh, of their family. You know, things that they do, they don't really try to, you know, make it happen. Um, I should say that's like a 50-50 thing, but I, like I said, I'm, I'm seeing more so a lot of individuals of, in the past to uh, sit at home and let their, their women go out and do their thing. But me, I, I, I just wanted to, you know, stress the fact that it's uh, any chance that you get a chance to work, any chance you get a chance to uh, get up out the bed and at least uh, provide and make it happen, I think that you should do, uh, especially for individuals who are totally blind. I'm telling you, I don't know about y'all, but man, I, I every t I, I put in, you know, work as far as uh, finding jobs and filling out applications and things like that, that of that nature, and it makes me feel good to know that at some point something's going to happen. And even if I don't uh, have a job at this point in time, I get up and try to you know, uh, help around the house. I don't feel that that's, you know, that's, uh, not manly or anything. I, I just think that this one, you know, one hand helps, uh, help out, uh, the other and what have you. I've always never been a person to be lazy, never. And I try to instill that in not in, not just my, 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 uh, sons, but people who are close, uh, to me as well. And this, uh, also, you know, kind of resonated even more so because I had a talk with one of my friends. I'm not going to mention the discussion, but it was something along those lines and whatnot. And it just by coincidence that I was going to be talking about that this particular topic, it is a man's duty to provide for his family. And also, I do a lot of uh, surfing on YouTube, and I found a clip that I'm, I'm going to play in a second from uh, one of my favorite rappers, Bun B, and he, specific, he specifically nailed it home in terms of what I was talking about. And I just wanted to get your opinion on that as well, you know, because, I mean, I don't see how a lot of these women out here allow their men just to not really provide, not really just, uh, you know, do things other than just help out amongst you know along you know with the family put it put it that way and what have you i think everything should be you know if not 50 50 for a man you know a little bit extra i mean he's always you know the provider the 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 caregiver not knocking the, you know saying that women can't do the same but i just somehow uh feel that it's a man's duty i mean to to, to go out and provide to go out and make it happen for that woman and whatnot and it's not about you trying to keep her it's just what you are uh were instilled as a, as a youngster if you had a, um, a man in the household to let them know that hey 
this is what my father did and this is what was instilled in me and this is what I'm going to do. And I'm, and I'm glad to say that I have two uh, other uh, brothers and they, they are some go-getters as well. So uh, thanks to uh, my father for instilling that in us as well. But I want to play this clip right quick and uh, just get you know your opinion about it. It's a clip from uh, one of my favorite rappers again, Bun B. And he talks about exactly how he feels and it resonates with me as well. So one second. So here's the clip and uh, let me know what you think about it. I didn't feel like a man if I wasn't working. Mm. I felt men worked. I felt if you can get up in the morning and you got the strength, you're supposed to go to work somewhere, mm -hmm. right? You're supposed to be doing something with your day. Even if you're not going to a physical site, right? You need to be up on the computer, on the phone or something working. And that's exactly how I feel, man, for real. I mean, it, man, it touched me so much. So I said, man, I, gotta, uh, I definitely got to use this clip in, in my video and um, at least kind of hammer that home. But yeah, if you have to, if you have, and then I also think about other individuals who have nothing, you know, nothing wrong with them. They got their arms and legs, they have their sight and they don't do anything. And I've spoken so many times with some of my people like, man, y'all just don't know if I have my sight, man, I work two jobs. I mean, I already, I have a degree already, haven't had the opportunity to, to use that. But as far as me, you know, not being able to, to provide, sometimes I feel, you know, through, no, through uh, no fault of my own, but I do do what I have to do. But if you have the ability to do, there shouldn't be no excuses, man. I'm telling you, God give you the chance to get up each morning to at least find something. And that's what I tell my uh, my people that those individuals who are not really, you know, trying to make the best of what they do have and what have you. But a lot of people take things for granted. So I just wanted to come on and just share my thoughts about that. And I definitely do feel that it is a man's duty to provide for his family. Any chance you can't do as a man definitely do so those are my words from third eye visions again my name is anthony please subscribe please hit that like button and definitely tell a friend and i'm out